sooner or later, I won't need this. 2019 has been quite a year, and uh, today I'm 36, today's my birthday, and uh, the first time I've actually been recording myself on camera after LASIK. I'm in the middle of stuff. Because my, my room's gonna be painted soon. Uh, there's just been so much that I wanna get into and I felt like what better way to kinda start off something new, something interesting, something I could have fun with uh, than vlogging. Yeah, vlogging in 2019, it's like, why start now? Pretty much inspiration. I, I think I've been really inspired via a lot of the content I've been watching recently. All of this learning that I've been doing since I've been taking off streaming. I haven't streamed a full week since December. And so we're in the fourth month of the year. It's been a long time. I've taken my hits with that, but it's a subject for another video. This is not an out with it. If you've watched my videos before, this is not an out with it. This is going to be a vlog. I've been doing a lot. I want to catch you guys up on so much that's been going on. I guess the, the rundown for those of you who are new to this face or, uh, you know, haven't talked to me in a while, uh, on January 9th, we bought a, uh, we moved into a new house. We bought a house. We're homeowners now. Um, I am in the process of uh, rebranding, approaching it from, you know, a company standpoint. Like I, I oh, I incorporated Avalon Star. We hired a design firm, uh, L2 Interiors, uh, based out of Santa Monica to kind of work on our house because we haven't, <laughs> when we w walked into this place and uh, I'll link our, our walkthrough in the description uh, of, you know, when we first walked into this place, we knew buying this place that we couldn't do it justice, that there was no way. Uh, and we hope to do a video on, you know, with Jen about how, you know, what the experience has been like. We haven't had furniture in, th you know, the, the months we've been here. It's almost been three months. That was the big thing. And things are actually, you know, starting to happen finally. Uh, with regards to that, there's a there's a gigantic wall that's next to me. Um, even today, I was productive. I think I, I held my my birthday a little bit differently than I usually do. Well, this morning we bought, uh, spent most of the morning trying to get Avengers Endgame tickets, which we finally did. Uh, big thanks to my friend Fusion who showed me the Regal app, which provided a nice backup to uh, you know, wanting to see it in the Dolby theaters because we love the Dolby experience at AMC, but AMC kind of, kind of shit the bed <laughs> with their website earlier. So I built a shelving unit from Catastrophic Creations, amazing company, and uh, we we had bought this sh the shelving, the shelving jungle gym, shelf based jungle gym for cats and. Uh, I was a little bit, we wanted our handyman to do it, the person who's been working on like the wall and all of the other things that have been going on in the house. You know, we wanted him to do it. And then, you know, coming up to today, I was like, you know what, I can do this. I'm a handyman kinda. So I, I did it myself and I'm pretty happy with it. Nothing looks completely awry. The cats are like Willow is, is enjoying it. And then, and of course, like a lot, if you've watched a lot of the videos that I've done, over the course of the past three or four years, um, I've talked a lot about like mental health and I've been approaching that a lot differently. Um, you know, tonight we're gonna be doing omakase, uh, my first omakase experience, which is sort of like, if you haven't uh, experienced that before, um, it's the chef pretty much gives you his choice for what you should have for sushi. And it's like usually like anywhere from a seven to like nine course or 12, 15 course meal. I've never done it myself. Uh, I felt it would be a really cool experience to try omakase for the first time. So we're doing that. Uh, probably have a little bit of video in there later. Bar six. Gold leaf on it. Fancy, babe. Fancy. You fancy. Fancy, smashy. Fancy. <laughs> so, what's, so what's this one? Okay, yeah, so that's sear toro with A5 wagyu with caviar, green onion, oh, chili shit, powder, babe. and uh, oh. truffle. 
You just you just like got him directly in he the said, heart. Wagyu. Yeah. Seventy five Wagyu. That's his like he loves freaking. <laughs> a lot of like a lot of stuff's been going on, and I wanted to do a lot of things. Uh, I've been really itching to get back to Twitch, and uh, I miss my community. But at the same time, I feel like there's a uh, Going back to what I said before about inspiration, there's been this void that I can, I feel like I can fill now that I never really paid much attention to YouTube because I felt like it needed to be, it needed to have a purpose. And I've been building like this rig, uh, this like YouTube slash Twitch video cam rig. Um, and I'm like, I need to use it. I need to use it for YouTube videos. And so that's what I want to do. And so I thought this morning, that what I want to do is create, you know, I'm 36 this year. We have about 36 to like 39 weeks left in the year. So I offered myself a challenge. I want to create a video, one video every week, at least one video every week uh, until the end of the year. So a minimum of 36 videos on this channel. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to talk about, but at the same time, I think the fact that I was always trying to look for something to talk about created this sense of, like, it gave me a reason to stall. And I don't like doing that anymore. I don't want to. I don't, I don't want to, I know myself a little better in that I don't want to give myself reasons to not do something. Uh, so... I posted a Final Fantasy video and uh, a UI video on Final Fantasy XIV. I want to do more of those and just try to give myself reasons to do more, to actually release more and not put all my eggs in one basket, which is what I seemingly love to do. And I'm currently doing uh, with a lot of things, but to a kind of evolve to a, a, in a sense where I can just vlog. Uh, I've been inspired by, um, not only my equipment, but also the style um, via like DSLR shooter um, and Gerald Undone. It's like YouTube is such a big place and I never really, I needed to kind of let YouTube integrate with me indirectly, I guess, <laughs> For, uh, in, order to, in order to get it. Um, so I'm trying this out and uh, Casual Brian is what is what Jen's been saying. Like she wants to see a casual Brian, and I hope you guys do too. I, I don't I don't know where this is gonna go, but I know I want to put out a video every week. Uh, I like much like my 12 year web career. You know, there are a lot of things I just put out there because I'm like, oh hey, this is cool. Everybody look at it and comment on it. So now I want to do that with with videos because with the investment we're putting into a place like this with our house and I'm purpose building this place for, you know, being a content creation studio, I got to start creating some content. So if you have any ideas of what you'd like to see me talk about, or if you like me just kind of spewing information into a camera, uh, leave me some comments. I'm really interested in building motivation to keep doing this. Uh, I want to talk about a lot of things like, you know, things I, I would usually forget. My time at Facebook, GitHub, um, stuff that's not work related. Uh, I found out I had um, an, um, aphantasia, which has been a huge thing. Uh, so that's stuff I've been talking about a lot with friends and I've been enjoying and I'd love to like talk more about it. Um, at least to chronicle it, much like my Out With It series. I'll leave it at that. Probably some extra footage of cats or omakase or something like that. But uh, consider this week one of 36 weeks of videos, at least one a week. And uh, what better way to celebrate my birthday than to try, try doing something new and scary and something that I've not done before. But until next week, I'll see y'all later. Bye guys.